Hello students, you are welcome to our English lesson. Today is our theme, Young People and Technology. Ok, let's start our lesson. New vocabulary. Listen and repeat. Desert Island Desert Island Golden Golden Greet Greet Human race Human race Inhabitant Inhabitant Launch Launch Messenger Messenger Mission Mission Represent Represent Solar System Solar System Space Exploration Space Exploration Spacecraft Spacecraft Transmit Transmit Whale Whale Exercise 3. Match the words in the two columns. For example, Space exploration. Space facts. They were small steps for one man, but they were giant leaps for mankind. The eagle has landed. Today, we look at some facts about man's exploration in space. Two, one, and liftoff. Liftoff of the 25th Space Shuttle mission, and it has cleared the tower. People talked about space travel for hundreds of years, but the rockets were not strong enough. On March 16, 1926, Robert H. Goddard, an American professor and physicist, launched a liquid-fueled rocket for the first time in history. German scientists followed his example with the V-2 rocket. This ballistic missile was the first object to fly into space on October 3, 1942. Soon, the space race between the USSR and the United States began. The Soviet Union launched the first man-made satellite on October 4, 1957. Less than a month later, Laika, the dog, was the first animal in space. On July 29, 1958, the Americans created the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, or NASA. The next year, the USSR's Luna 2 was the first spacecraft to land on the moon. Soviet Russia scores a dramatic victory in the exploration of space with the launching of the first rocket to hit the moon. An historic scientific feat simulated in these scenes which showed the course of the multi-stage rocket carrying the 858-pound lunic. The 1960s was an important period for space exploration. On April 12, 1961, the Russian astronaut Yuri Gagarin was the first human in space. On July 21, 1969, Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin were the first humans to walk on the moon. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. By the mid-70s, the space race ended when the two superpowers joined for the Apollo-Soyuz test project. Let me call to express my very great admiration for your hard work, your total dedication in preparing for this first joint flight. During the 1980s, the Americans and Russians worked together to create many space shuttles and stations. The Mir space station orbited Earth from 1986 to 2001. Cosmonaut Valery Polyakov spent 14 months on board that craft in 1995. Three years after that, the larger International Space Station launched as a satellite and research lab. During the 1990s, Projects like the Hubble Space Telescope showed us detailed images of the universe. As the new millennium began, the near Shoemaker robotic space probe became the first to orbit and land on an asteroid. Space tourism became a reality in 2001. Millionaire and engineer Dennis Tito visited the International Space Station. 
Within three years, Spaceship One gave its technology to Richard Branson's space tourism company, Virgin Galactic. In 2004, the Opportunity, one of NASA's two Mars rovers, discovered the first meteorite on another planet. Humans began searching for planets that look like Earth by launching the Kepler Space Observatory in 2006. In the early 2000s, China got involved in the space race by sending its first astronaut into space, and later by establishing a lunar exploration program. In 2011, NASA ended its space shuttle program by retiring all its orbiters. And nose gear touchdown and the end of a historic journey. And to the ship that has led the way time and time again, we say farewell, Discovery. That year, the U.S. also sent the Curiosity rover towards Mars, and Russia sent the biggest ever space telescope into orbit. Humans have always been curious about space. Despite some tragic mistakes, scientists will continue to wonder at the limitless possibilities space exploration has to offer. Exercise 4. Complete the sentences with the appropriate verb in the correct tense. Exercise 6. Imagine you are sending a time capsule into space. In the time capsule you can put five things that represent your nation. Decide what to put in it. The lesson is over. Thank you for your attention. Goodbye.